Welcome to this Windows channel and this is to talk about a very cool feature coming to OneDrive for every device. Now, of course, we had talked about one of the cool features that rolled out in the Insider Previews, which is the ability to have files on demand. So, of course, in your settings, you could just, you know, choose file on demands uh, if you want it, which is here. Now, that's, of course, a feature that we're testing out, but something new is coming and going to be rolled out slowly. And this is quite cool. It's a file history option. So, of course, now the file on demands, you see that there's a little check marks for the sync stuff. There's a cloud that says, well, all of that is in the cloud, not synced everywhere. Uh, what's really nice about this is that there will be a 30-day file history rolling to OneDrive soon. Now, if you've used uh, because, you know, some people might say, well, I've got that, you know, I've got my, my office files and I can go back. Yes, if you use my office, uh, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, you can actually go back in time. It already existed in Office, a file history of your Office documents. And which was nice because, you know, Office documents, you tend to write stuff. And after several pages, you might want to go back to uh, a version that was earlier or, you know, it's, it's cool for that. So um, it's not really clear why they waited so long to do it also for PC, but now it will be available. You'll have the possibility as soon as it rolls out. So don't search for it right now because uh, I don't think anybody has it now, but it starts rolling out today apparently. So, uh, you know, slowly people will have that feature added. It's going to say, oh, okay, you've got file history now. And that file history will keep a version of every of all your personal files. Every picture that has been modified, every uh, document, everything in every type of format possible that has had a change over time will be in there. So you'll be able to go back and say, okay, this picture I've modified with Photoshop, but I didn't keep the original. So um, you'd go back to the date where you remember it was still in your, on, on your PC. If you sync, of course, to OneDrive, and that's very important have to have your OneDrive sync uh, working automatically like I do and um, you'll be able to retrieve an older file. Really, really cool. Um, if you erase stuff, you know, for example, sometimes you'll take pictures of your phone, you'll do things, then you erase some stuff from your phone. Uh, you know, I use OneDrive on my Android phone because it, uh, it, it it's amazing how it works well. You know, OneDrive at the beginning, I, I started using it because they pushed it in Windows 8.1, well, Windows 8 basically. But it wasn't very reliable at the beginning. Uh, but I gotta say now, they've done such a great job at making this so reliable. I mean, I take a picture and it takes like seconds and it's available online. I, I don't even need to, to, to you know, plug in the phone or send the picture through email. It's in my OneDrive folder and I love that. So with file history, you've, took, you know, you've taken some pictures uh, two weeks ago, decided, oh, well, you know what? I don't need these, I'll, I'll just delete them. And then you realize, well, okay, there was one in there that I did delete that I wanted to keep. Well, you'll just go back two weeks and get that picture. It's still going to be there. As long as you stay within the frame of 30 days, which is pretty cool, pretty cool. So, of course, as soon as I have that available, I will demonstrate this feature. Um, but um, it's, you know, anybody's guess, it starts rolling out today. Um, it might take months before everybody gets it. But I think it's an amazingly cool feature that's added to OneDrive, making it even more interesting and even more, I think, one of the great options for backing up, backing up your files on the web. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.